Uh, we have some more breaking news to report. Special counsel David Weiss says he will seek a grand jury indictment of Hunter Biden by the end of this month. Joining me now once again is MSNBC legal analyst Lisa Rubin. So explain what's going on here, Lisa. You know, the the U.S. attorney is essentially saying to the judge in this case, he had a status report due saying he intends to file an indictment against Hunter Biden on what appears to be the gun charges against him by the end of September. You'll remember that when there was an initial plea agreement, Katie, there were tax charges and also a pretrial diversion agreement stemming from some gun charges. And that was supposed to be a non-issue then. The gun charges would be over. He wouldn't be facing any consequences for, for that. Does this make clear that David Weiss always wanted to charge him with this and maybe was inhibited from doing so? What does this tell no, us? No, not necessarily. I think what this tells you is that in the wake of that plea agreement falling apart, uh -huh. David Weiss is intending to go forward on some charges in what they refer to here as the firearm information. There were two separate criminal cases started at around the time that Hunter Biden was expected to plea. Those tax charges have been withdrawn. There is some expectation that they will refile those, perhaps in a different jurisdiction. You'll remember David Weiss now has uh, authority from the um, from the attorney general to yeah. proceed in other jurisdictions there. This is in the firearm case. Hunter Biden had a firearm while he was in possession of narcotics. Got it. And uh, Merrick Garland made David Weiss a special counsel just a few weeks ago.